Tonight we'd like to pay a special tribute to our friend Shoji Tabuchi. Shoji passed away last week on Friday, August 11th. He was truly the epitome of the American dream. He was born and raised in Japan and began playing fiddle at age seven. It was at age 16 his life changed when he saw Roy Acuff in concert. Shoji talked to Acuff following the concert and expressed his enthusiasm. Acuff said, if you ever come to the United States, look me up. With those words of encouragement, Shoji, with only $500 in his pocket, moved to the United States to pursue his dream of playing American country music. Shoji made his Branson debut in 1982 at the invitation of Chisai Childs, and he soon after became the headliner of Bill Daly's country music world. In 1990, Shoji built his own 2,000-seat theater, and he quickly became the king of Branson. The Shoji Tabuchi Show starred Shoji, his daughter Christina, and was masterfully produced by his incredibly talented wife, Dorothy. His show was a big, big show. Orchestra, singers and dancers, big production numbers, and audiences, well, they absolutely loved it. He was sold out two and three times every day. Offstage, Shoji was an amazing man. The Ozarks fit his enthusiasm for life. He was a very loving and devoted family man, and then there was his love for golf and fishing, and he excelled at both. He and Dorothy were always giving so much back to the community. In 2006, Shoji was a recipient of the prestigious Missourian Award, which acknowledged his contributions to Missouri tourism and his generous giving throughout the state. The Branson Marching Band received several new sets of uniforms thanks to the generosity of the Tabuchis. Branson owes so much to Shoji. He entertained millions of our visitors and gained us national notoriety with appearances on 60 Minutes, CBS This Morning, Regis and Kathy Lee, Nashville Now, and publicity with the Wall Street Journal, the New York Times, Time Magazine, and many more. We will miss our friend and our neighbor. We send our condolences to Dorothy, Christina, his family, his friends, and his many fans. As part of our tribute tonight, we'd like to take you back to a never seen before appearance of Shoji on Branson Country USA. The date was May 2nd, 2014. Shoji had just completed his appearance here on our show, and we went to a commercial break. On the break, we asked Shoji if he would like to come on out <laughs> on stage and jam. His eyes lit up and a big smile erupted on his face and he said, let's go. I want to thank uh, Chris and Shauna on our staff who went through nine years of audio and video to find this piece. It was never for broadcast. We didn't plan it. We didn't rehearse it. We just grabbed his arm and said, you want to jam? And he was pretty excited. He was. He was. He looked at you while he's playing. He looked at me. Yep. He said two things. He said, this is fun and we jam it. <laughs> He had the greatest smile. Here's our friend Shoji doing what he loved to do best.
great job.